<laughs> the Willowmeister. I won't say a few things about the William. I made a YouTube community post for the Prayer Warriors on my husband. Uh, what he done was pass out and heart stop. At least 45 seconds to a minute. He don't even remember. Do you remember William? Your mama said you were like, uh, uh, what are you people doing to me? Cutting your shirt off and all that. Good gosh, bro. We're in here talking biblical, biblical things, medical things, fairies. <laughs> we were talking about that. I was telling him. Thank you for your prayers for William. He's going to need a pacemaker. There's no doubt about this. What they want to do against their medical superiority is, uh, <laughs> We agree. His family calls me today. Our entire family does not believe in the umbrella of the triangle. <laughs> Many of the family members are concerned that this here hospital isn't significant enough to help my husband begin with. And it's not. Yeah. Go in pacemaker though. And what they want to do to make sure they ensure that uh, <clears throat> someone that we don't know <laughs> in the uh, thing up there that you see up there, in that system there, uh, has control over healing. That was one thing I would never allow to happen, first of all. I went to get him some ice up there and I thought, if one of these people <laughs> say one dang thing against the cardiology umbrella, I'm going in. This is kind of a place that I understand a telemetry board. They don't need to educate me. They might have books and the tools, but we have the book and the doctor. Then there it was again. I'm collecting all kinds of bags, all kinds of material. The little meister. And he don't even know the echocardiogram people come in. And uh, genuinely, the only reason they wanted to do that is as heart patients know, the heart patients, those who aren't. <laughs> this place is driving me mad. <laughs> all right, don't tear it down. I don't need this cardiac unit. <laughs> no. <laughs> but yeah, we're talking politics in here. We're talking uh, fairies. Uh, we're talking about who is running this country and who has control over my husband's heart. Okay, they did the echocardiogram for his ejection fraction. You, you can't go throwing these terms around. <laughs> for, if, if your patient is laying there and they don't understand what's already been done to you, it's like talking in a foreign language or foreign relations. They're like scared to death. You don't throw a word pacemaker around without knowledge of somebody around there. What's going on with you people, man? You medical people need to realize you might went to school, so did I. You only need for a dollar sign. Remember 2020? Remember 2020 for medical? You think we put our faith in this trash? No, we won't tell like it is. In the tabernacle of Tammy. We can talk about the Holy of Holies in here. That Jesus was the last slaughtered lamb, all you richies. He was slaughtered. Most people don't even know that. They don't even care to know this. That in the old covenant of Judaism, they had to kill lambs to go to the festivity rituals of the Holy of Holies in the tabernacle in the synagogues and proclaim Jesus in this dispensation with this when he was slaughtered. Father, forgive them. They don't have enough in their cash out. Uh, well, uh, maybe. <laughs> I remember a video from St. Dominic's hospital in 2009 at the cardio unit. They're showing just that up here trying to laugh. This is not a funny situation. It's just so easy to see through it now when you have the real Christ. Don't put your faith in somebody in a white jacket. That's not where your faith lies. If it does, you're in trouble. Remember 2020? Remember these people that went to school to encourage uh, certification? Somehow they just abandoned you. And you want to put your faith back in now? Nope. They're there in place to do a job. To edify them. You got the wrong doctor. Let alone the nurse practitioner and the like. Okay, here's for an example. <clears throat> when we are nursing it, I'm like, ma'am, uh, would you please tell me once again what they're doing to my husband? Why they're sending him home today? She didn't even know. She knew nothing. Well, his cardiac test came back okay. I said, no, they did not. What kind of communication racket are you people pulling? Just because I press and said, forgive them, Father. They don't know what they're doing. Just like that nurse. Proving all things. She's here for this. You can't tell me if otherwise, because I'm one. I told him that. So don't, be, don't let me be talking to people like that. I'll tell them all. Just sit at home, come back with a monitor. And, well, you know. I said, ma'am, I did. And then the data will collect at least for a week, two weeks, or less. You bring it, you bring it back, you return it, they collect the data to see if anything's irregular in the cardiac unit. I don't know. Yeah, I know. You better believe you better have a test. For once again. Oh, he's been discharged for about that. Four hours. <laughs> the problem is, is that clock on the wall. Mm -hmm. It's not quite 2 p.m. Central Standard Time. Something's got to kick back in. Remember? <laughs> once 2 3 comes about, hey, man, he's out of there. <laughs> They must think some of us don't know this. <laughs> and we'll block it. <laughs> so angry. <sighs> Let's just say your daddy's in the hospital. Laying there, not feeling well, having the issue, right? And you don't want your daddy. And his nurse comes in and don't know anything more. Oh, oh okay. Is it faster? Well, there you go. Sorry, you're burning, brother. <laughs> Let's find out the medical. Hang on here now. Oh, oh. Okay, well, I'm going to get William some ice up there. The ice machine broke. You would think a place like a cardiac unit can fix an ice machine, right? Don't you think a cardiac unit can fix an ice machine? Oh, it's past two o'clock. We don't know what that means. <laughs> oh no, honey, it was four hours ago. Me and Mama was talking at ten thirty. No, they told me the truth. <laughs> yeah, eleven thirty. Eleven thirty came. Eleven thirty passed. What kind of racket besides tennis balls, brother? Are they trying to over you, man? Open up that window. Scans down these places. Oh yeah. Yeah. She didn't know anything about William's condition. Nothing about his discharge. The nurse. That's already in. Her name's right there. It says already in. What does that mean, register? I've heard that. that cost, register? <laughs> the heart doctor would take it by keeping it to Monday or Tuesday to do that. But then he said, well, you could come back for uh, an outpatient to it. He went to that. Sure, he went that. That cuts that off in circumcision, so to speak. And you just come back and collectively do it again and again and again and again and yeah. again and again and again and again. And again and again and again and again. I know that. They won't do that. Pacemaker. It's like your nurse doesn't even know. Okay, now you put this word pacemaker in the ears of my husband. And a nurse coming in and don't know this? We have an issue. 
It's a lot more steps. 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 It's a lot more so those will be the main two brooms in the broom family. He with cardiac issues, Well, Ralph's army, he did a lot of them up. VA Wonder Woman theories. Yeah, that's about right, he was in his 50s, buddy. Wow, woke up on Sunday, he goes to the tabernacle, and he walks around, right in front of the piano. It was church related. Remember, told me that he wasn't going to go, and all of a sudden, he said, we don't go. Oh, wow. Nobody called her, honey. You go ahead. Hello? Damn. So many family members call, like my YouTube community, uh, community post. Yeah, yeah, here, let's step in my office, shall we? <laughs> you think you're going to tell me about cardiac kidney? You got your Friday. Now we're in the bathroom. <laughs> this is some serious shit. But you ain't going to play with my husband like you play with me there, fiddles. You got it? Just get in there and wash off with your knowledge and lack thereof. Good God. Good Lord. The only two brooms that had cardiac issues was Ralph Brooke, United States Army. He died at the door of where we had our home in Bastille, Mississippi, on Gates Road that killed us and almost killed us in Hurricane Katrina. I am furious. You ain't going to get nothing done if you don't fight for your family. They don't like me? Well, I'm all broken up about it. Shit. No. <laughs> you need people to fight. Otherwise, hi, how are you doing today? How are you feeling? What do you think I am, you goofard? <laughs> I don't play when it comes to cardiac. This is a reverberation of it over and over and over. It's these lying devils. Shit. And the one he's speaking to has a massive degree in medical. I think she concurs with me, not them. Good God. Yeah, rough room. The very front door of where we lived in Bastille. He fell right in front of his sister, Deborah, who had no knowledge of cardio. She's a country girl. How to help Ralph. But he would have had a massive heart attack. There was no hope for Ralph. When we moved in, there was all kinds of pills from the VA. That system he loved so much. Screwed up his mind so much. Dear God. Why don't you serve this? That place ruined Ralph's brain. They didn't just mess with it. They destroyed it. I know. I'm married to one. I get to hear the stories of what they've done to Ralph. They destroyed him. That's what they've done to Ralph in the VA. Wow. Well, they didn't get all raised to be stupid. Excuse me, man. The VA down here is about this. I'm going to fuck with my husband. I'll be right on the front board. I've spoken to three cardiologists today with more knowledge than they have from a book. Oh, yes. That might be the route we'll go, I'm thinking. You better move it, you little walking liar. This is my area. I don't need no introduction. Until him cardio. Shit. I'm not feeling angry about this. The entire room family is. I just put a YouTube community post up for the prayer warriors. And there's a bunch of wing nuts reading my stuff who don't even matter to me. They post it for them. That's how stupid people are. People are coming to my Gmail, calling me the most ridiculous things on the planet. Ridiculous. What are they doing reading my stuff? You travesty stupid. Get off my YouTube post. No one cares about you devils. You're flattering yourself. These people on YouTube genuinely believe they own the YouTube community post, just like these damn dogs. Okay? They think you can't use a post. This is for me. That's narcissism. Somebody talked to my Gmail. You narcissist, thunder cunt. I'm thinking, how do you know anything there, fool? Get off my YouTube community post. We ain't got nothing to do with you, people. You don't own YouTube community post. You be wicked devils. You just can't stand somebody that's strong as me. We're here if you'd like to find us. I've lived a hard life, but this motherfucking shit ain't gonna get to me, man. I'm gonna live. I've already gotten sick from it. Shit. They know it. Man, you're sick, I guess. I'm aware of this. I'm not leaving. They want to leave so they can talk stupid to William. So they can fill his head with ideology. That's just not true. Now they want him discharged today. Well, like I said, that was four hours ago. I'm thinking here when we got to deal with insurance. When does it re-clock in for home number 24? The military people know. I'm sure the VA knows. When does your insurance policy kick in in your 24-hour clock, dummies? What time is that you in the medical field? What is it? When does insurance kick in? Somehow another paperwork might scratch together. You know how you down there and you get it. Yeah, man, could be crack. This one, medical coding and billing. Been there, done that, live that shit. The medical code. Here's the code. Here's the code. Huh. You better believe I'm furious about this shit. But it's deja vu for me. I couldn't do anything. I was laying in the bed, stranded, with their lies. This industry can no longer lie to me, even in this bathroom. If you need more entertainment, I'll get in here. Let's see here. Don't charge me for this. Just because it's in this room. Let's see this bag recharged, this recharged. But you know, in medical billing and coding, you never can see them. You'll charge for toilet paper. <laughs> Kleenex, glasses, cups. If you turn the water on, it probably knows that and probably charges you for a water bill. Say, hmm. Anybody out there to try to tell me what to do again? <laughs> Wait a minute. Holy fetch. I'm a rich woman, man. Look at this funny. And it is. That last one now. If this ain't as funny as you can get, three cents is on the floor. That's right, baby. Free, free. You bet. Biohazard. Okay, let me look at this discernment call. The only thing in here is a biohazard trash can. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense. <laughs> Red for biohazard one, girls, of course. This one for the linen. There's no trash can in here for either. They probably charged it for it. They might be outside the door. This is very vexing for the Broom family because they lost Ralph from this. They lost their father from this. Barbara, Deborah, Mavis, Ralph, and Royce. They all lost their father. Barely 60 years old to this particular type of unit. Cardio. And they're blowing up the phones after we fought Smegas. People are in other perils, and these people that sit on their butts worrying about how much they're drawing in their YouTube channel. Okay, I'm a YouTuber. They don't mind being taken down for going against the system. Oh, they're not talking about the system, no. Forgot about that. Shh. That man out there I've been married to for 20 years plus just fell out, heart stopped, and they're already discussing discharging him. You think I'm not angry? You think I, I won't fight the establishment? 
unless we're wrong. There's not one word that's come out of their mouth I have counteracted, attacked, or concurred. And how much concurrence? Nada. You don't need to be in here anyway. I'll have a beer and get out of here. You also raise family degrees? That's why we call it. Know your family and quit trying to pretend you know somebody else's jack because they hit the YouTube channel. The YouTube channel's free. Well, maybe not. They might charge me because I'm on the phone here. Is there a medical code for using the internet? This is guest. You're not a guest. What is this? A hotel, motel, skydown? Well, that kind of ends. You think about it. Yeah, you know, bathroom, toilet, shower, sink, bed, remote control, television. It is a hotel, motel, skydown. Mm -hmm. With the lies. All I'm looking for is lies. I can hear the truth. I'm listening to the lies. I'm watching the lies. And feeling so sorry for families that have no understanding. Remembering what this was like on my own plate as well as working in it. Don't, don't think I'm not fully aware of your clinical situation. And what you'll have to say about the nurse's station. Shh. I went to get my eyes. And I stood back with a hospitalist, one of the cardiologists, and several nurses. And I just listened. That's all I did. I thought, unbelievable. All I could say to him was sorrow Saturday. Man, this place is busy. It is all the time. I thought, well, why don't you quit, you lazy target? Get the hell out of here and give it to a job. Somebody wants a paycheck. Oh, it certainly is. Like it's a low and fair cardio. Remember 2020? Oh, no, 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 me trying to fool me. Hate me for the right reason. Don't hate me for the wrong. How many of you YouTubers be willing to get in the bathroom and tell the truth, man? About the system. Shoot, man. Vloggable material, of course. Can't handle them. They can play with me. I don't care. No hospitals. I keep reiterating this. Scotty, me, the family, all of us. The family. Prayer warriors are people that believe in Jesus. If they want to type on my YouTube post, that's fine. But when I post that, it says prayer warriors. It's not to the dark and devils. The prayer warriors on this universe know how to call me. Know how to come see me. They're not going to type what those weirdo devils are. Certain YouTubers might type. And they're typing in kindness. And a gesture of kindness. But they're not blowing up my phone. These devils just talk to me more than anybody that loves Jesus. And they too them. It says prayer warriors. It doesn't say walking devils sitting on your butt trying to draw on a paycheck. They think they're talking to you. This is when I'm coming to me and say, and this is narcissist. Now, if I wait a here, now let's use some depth raising in the bathroom. How does anyone have the logic ability to type and know anything at all about that YouTube community post, first of all? Secondly, what I posted about William. Third, why answer when you're poking around nose at and you're not on my channel? What are you doing there? How do you know? What are you doing lurking around like some snot nosed, nosy narcissist stuck up or sticky cunt? Hang on and typing. Those are the devils you need to steer clear of. They're stupid. They're absolutely abstract to me. They're absolutely loud and stupid. <laughs> Dummy. They don't be talking to you, weirdos. I mean, y'all don't own shit, you pushy fruit nuts. Get it to your thick skull. These little communities that can't even get off their butt and go down to the community place and own city and state. Your community is stupid. Your community is your city and your state's downtown place where it says community center, civic center. It's not YouTube, platforms, studios, creators, communities. If you do, please give all the derivative payment to paypal.me slash me not for life. You don't own YouTube. I don't care who's watching this. Whatever you think about people on YouTube, you don't own the app. You don't own YouTube community posts. If you want to sit back and act like that kind of crap and gossip with a bunch of foolish people, you're wasting your life. When you land here, you deserve it. When you land in cardiac unit, you deserve it. By being a dummy. By serving Satan and his magical system. You are. YouTube is a website. It's an app. These people think these little weirdos. God, God help them. They don't know what they do. Look at on your YouTube community post and then come into my Gmail. Nobody invited them there. They're looking at my life. Because they ain't got one. They hide behind theirs. The absolute fruit cards, man. You don't even know Christ. They couldn't even teach Jesus to you, man. They couldn't even teach Jesus to you. I'm not going to show them their fruit cards. Told you we'd win that debate. They can't even teach Jesus. They don't even know him. That's how much of a loser they are. Their community fails Christ. That's all. They're crazy. They don't know Jesus. And I love it. I love the fact that we won that debate. They don't know Christ. They can't teach his word. They can't read his word. They can't study his word. And they can't teach you nothing. Swing them down for the Christ follower. Yeah, punks. They can't even teach Jesus to you. Behold, barely, sharply rebuke, exhort these terms of edification and a warrior, not a wimp. I'm taking care of that man against the establishment. They're not going to steamroll my husband. If you want yours to sit back and say, thank you so much, doctor. You're such a liar, but thank you. If you don't want to fight for your family member, that's your problem. If you want to post frivolous prayers and believe in God like a force to get him to do what you want him to do, then you're throwing your prayer like that. I don't ask for prayer. He doesn't. I don't. I don't ask for self-prayer. Me, no. The prayer warrior is teams we make up in the state of Mississippi. And they'll look at your YouTube community posts and things to them on their stupid community that's not even a community. Look on community coffee. They're not a community. They're just a bunch of people sitting on the butt on YouTube. How dumb can they be? God help them for medical. We need strong men and strong women that are going to enter this medical demonic field and be godly for a change. Don't make it a crunch number or a quo or is a religion or is that stupid intake. And what is your religion? Step back and say, I repeat thee. Is Jesus on the other? That's not on there. It's still not on there. What religion are you? We know to say religion killed him. Other, Jesus. Or keep it blank. I don't care what church you go to. No, I don't. His name is Jesus. You're not going there for a social club. You're not going there because you want to follow your pastor everywhere. Your friends have transferred to another church, so you go with them. That's not Jesus. No, that's, that's who Jesus called out. He tore the temples down. He ate over the knee. He wasn't interested in your pharisaical ideology of him. He knew what you were filled with. Yourself. People are watching me. God, quit throwing your prayers at God like a genie in the bottle. Please stop. Thank you. It's ridiculous, man. All right. We're getting discharged after two o'clock. Yes, sir. Bye, right, girl. Just so you know, 2 p.m. Central Standard Time when your insurance kicks in. For a 24-hour period. Just tell military men and women that they know. They know. Mm -hmm. His work won't be done here. In order to remove the responsibility off them, they have to discharge him. Isn't that right, medical people? The license. We can't do that. We can't afford to risk our license. Uh, so we're so angry. 
And this is the bathroom. I wonder what code this is. I'm gonna have to pay for this. My dad used to laugh about how much Kleenex cost. If you don't believe me, find uh, James Evans on Good Time when his wife's gallbladder was coming out. And he got the TV and the flowers. It goes all the way back to the 70s. And all of a sudden, he started to see the bill. And he was pushing the Kleenex for her to use it because everything's accounted for in medical, billing, and coding. You think we'll ever resolve William's issue? He needs a pacemaker. So, the steps to go was echocardiogram. I refused to leave it without an echo. Did he get one? Yes. And the nurse didn't know anything about my husband's cardio issue. Hey. All this place did was prove it again. Now the life of my husband is in the hands of the biker. My hands has been in my whole damn life. I don't need nobody to tell me nothing about anything. I did that, darling. Um, it's either you gonna calf my husband. There's no need for a nuclear stress test. That's medical dummies. It's your book knowledge. Yay. <sighs> non cardio unit. I'll die fighting for that one. <laughs> and? Nobody's fought with nobody out there. I'm fighting with the knowledge of the truth of politics, bureaucracy, political bullshit, in this medical industry that you serve. We all have to have it. That the errors are so ridiculous, man. And so many don't know it. Who does? The medical industry people. In clinical. And the like. Oh, yes. You can see which nurse was wearing, how many patients they got, how frustrated they are. Quit. It's real simple. Quit. Quit. If it's so vexing, you went to school for the money. And some status of a jacket or a scrub. Maybe I can wear my scrub and somebody will think I'm the doctor. Have you ever come across them? They'll come in and be like, Doctor, and they know damn well they ain't nothing but the food chain person bringing you the damn food. Doctor, and they'll just say yes, like I own the title. Don't even lie to me in the bathroom. Huh? What was the reason she didn't want me out here? Oh, she's like, stay in there. Oh, she's like, stay in there. No, I assume she was doing something private. Wait, wait, wait. Lord, Lord. Okay, so this clock is wrong up here. You mean the 2 p.m.? It's fast? Speak that 30 minutes slow, I'll know. 30 minutes slow. William's been discharged about five hours. I know, but you need to discharge to outpatient procedures either for the dead burn ridiculous gas or the pacemaker or monitor. It's going to be one of the three. There is no other option. I'll get that. I know they are. You must have really, really been tired. You're not in the world. Did you keep it clear under his head? A lot of guys. It's a little bit. The entire family, William, was not going to have any procedure here. They couldn't do it here. I know they can't. What did Barbara say? What did you say? She said, I'm not going to get in. She said, yeah, don't talk. Don't be tingled to hot bell like that. They didn't expect that with William. Daddy said it today, man, when we talked. They regret it. They have a regret now. But they get an airlifter like they wanted to. Daddy said what they got in the maid was just moving to. Yeah, basically. All chargers. It is. Okay. Hey, take that. Where's your chargers? Hey, what are they going to choose to do here? I want to talk to the nurse when the camera died. Thank you very much. Can I see any teachers yet? We don't stand down. Thank you very much. Okay, I had a conversation with the nurse. This was highlighted here, and thank you for the prayers. William, there's people that pray for you, honey. I want you to know that on the internet. There's also devils that walk around our wall, acting like they matter at all in the kingdom of God again. Know that too. A bunch of people walk around my YouTube community posts like they own YouTube, but other than that stupidity. Um, keep going, coming, demons. You're help. You can't choose Jesus in your community. Just drink community coffee, you guy. Dummies. Hang in there, darling. Don't let you in that. It's kind of a mandatory deal. That's right. Mandatory. Mandatory. Honey, you going to pay for that dinner? Here's your cup, honey. Do you want it? Well, yeah, my cup, yeah. What happened to your ice? Oh, my God. You sure you want it? Huh? Look at that. The freezer's broken. I mean, the ice machine's broken. The freezer's broken. Redeem the court head. Who? Redeem court head. Wow. They're tied in with inspiration. Wait, they ain't heard first. This isn't as heavy as it was when I brought it in. They ain't heard about inspiration. That's your bad line. Why is it just as heavy as when I brought it in? I feel like you're missing something, darling. Okay, white charger. Two headphones. You got your bag, though. I don't know, but mine is my bag. It's okay, dude. Where's your medication? I got my pocket. Is that it? Yeah. Anyway, that was like, oh, Jesus Christ. All right, here we go. I think I got everything in this bag. Hi, darling. I'm about to trip, girl. I couldn't. I'm actually the main entrance, darling. I got so tired. Really. As I resolve this issue, the communities have tried to act like they love Jesus do not love him. They cannot teach you Jesus Christ. I speak boldly rebukable like my Savior. I don't stand down in places like this. He is discharged after his insurance reached again. I gotta take care of me. Frivolous nonsense. Uh oh. <laughs> Elevators. What do you do, man? I'm oh, sorry. I'm doing a good job. Wait a minute. <laughs> Here we go. How's the door freedom? Now listen, when I get up here, I get stuffy like I'm skipping turkey. I get lost phobia to the nonsense garbage. It's significant enough to deal with pacemaker. Only a place in outpatient with me. You never know. And I remember the days, and maybe some people did. And you ever wanted to question its strategy? Back in the days when the ambulance beat you up, a witness could get in the ambulance with you. If it was your husband, the wife could get in the ambulance. If it was your child, you as a mother or father could get inside the ambulance. That's also the book of Titus for two witnesses to admonish. There's no witness of a family member in the back of an ambulance to give the truth of what's going on inside the ambulance. There's that medical truth factor under Christ. This one's the United States Air Force. Maybe they're not filled with devils in the VA. Maybe. I just tell it like it is. If somebody don't like it, move along. I don't get flying around. It's my husband. I can treat him the way I want to, but they're not going to. Me and Gil was talking about it. Me and his family did. That's called family. Prayer warriors pray. These weirdos think that they're part of my team of prayer warriors are so stuck on them. See my YouTube community post? You don't own it. You're a fool. You don't own the YouTube. You're not part of our family of Christ. You can't even teach him. We love that you care because I need good. You need to shut up and listen up. When you don't understand it, you're hush. In a minute, you can't teach the Bible. If you paint yourself, so you can teach it. You failed. But there's people that used to remember back in the day. Oh, yes. 
And when the witness got in the ambulance, that's the book of Titus of two witnesses to admonish. It's still scientific. What's wrong with people, man? Tell you gotta take care of your family members. They're the ones that want to discharge William, and all the family agreed anyway. Everybody asked me, Tammy, is that place safe enough? Do they know what they're doing, Tammy? They didn't say ask YouTube's community post. They know I have the knowledge of it. I lived it. They know these hospitals down here. These YouTubers aren't down here. If you invite them on your channel, they're watching you. They're watching you. They're up in your nosy business. They're nosy freaks. They're not part of your family. Keep them out of it. Get them away from you. They don't belong there. They belong right with Satan's gonna keep them. They're Satan's children. They're not Christ. That's not a judgment. That's a fact. They don't know Jesus Christ. None of that community tie. I told y'all they didn't know how. And that's a winner on the Christ side, not Tammy's side. They don't know Jesus. They don't know him. All they know is gossip, frivolous nonsense, and their community of lies. Gossip, slander, belligerent, harassment. That's what they know. They don't know Jesus. They don't know anything. Unless you fill them in. They're watching you. You're not watching them. They're so stuck on themselves with that word narcissistic. Jesus will take care of you. You're not William's wife. That's to the evil. Evil can stay where they belong. We see right through this. I understand this shit. I've done this for a living. This is why I earn a check. You're damn right it is. Sorry, when we get upset, it happens to be the knowledge of the truth. Get out of the truth. Yeah. Yeah. Which is probably sloppy Joe's, then. Yeah, is it any better? Probably sloppy Trump, Joe's, Trump, man. No doubt. National Guard, but it's the same thing. Trump picked all that, yeah. man. Trump, Not he, the, uh, he, he fired every single one yeah, of them. He, he fired the fairies. He fired every one of them. Yeah. He said that they people, that, 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 the he said people, it, 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 it being taken care of in certain ways, <laughs> and other, other dying or whatever they might be. But he said people, and, and, and they go so long, they turn around. Gang green. Uh, you remember Ricky up there? That's all they did. That's why Trump fired them all. He fired every single one of them. Yeah, I'm Wonder Woman, Rainbow, which could be 5,000 systems and up there. He tore down. It's probably better now. That's right. My bedroom, and he ain't that Trump. Uh, was that that Mr. Wishy Swap yeah, Joe? He's like, goof, dark red. Yeah, what a wing that. He'll be in him, you know, they would have got it. He's probably talking Spanish. Yeah. And or uh, got it from friends. He's going to fire. They fired him on fire because he, he said what he wanted to say about Biden and all that uh, and how he for Trump and stuff. Is CNN for the truth? Is Fox for the truth? Yeah, Fox is, but Fox ain't good. Fox got, None of us going to say yes today. No, they got the uh, network. It's all not real news. And all cable company cares. You got to tell them if you want this. It's huh? called News Match. What? News Match. That's all conservative. I can't stand news to begin with, but I have no idea what a News Match is. It sounds no, like news, a lantern. News, they don't watch a cigarette and a baby. That's what everybody news? wants. What's it called? News Match. Or news Match? Like that. What's that? It's on like... Man, that's a problem bit. Okay, check it out. See that Mr. Tag? Yeah. I really thought we could throw up a few moments enough to get you off to change the narrative with that being said at the end of the day, or perhaps not the end of the day. Yeah. I thought those were people misusing the old Magnolia a Mississippi license. Yeah. And I approached one and it had January 2025. Yeah. I said, okay, they have physically taken down their puke white, William. You see the Magnolia? Yeah. Flower. And in God we trust is gone. It's on these, I believe, the ones we're on now. Yeah, it's on our flag. Uh, there is no longer in God we trust on take, the Mississippi tag. It's out of there for Satan. It's out of there. That was uh, that was the, the, that was the, uh, the guideline. Take reads. The only way I change the, the other flag if I can put what I want to on this flag. No, I encourage the uh, Chichi fairies to actually get their car tags in a steel color. Take reads. I wanted to say in God we trust and our flag. No, we need to say in man we trust, in the dollar we trust, no. in myself I trust, in the medical I trust. I will say I pledge allegiance to the, the government. The government. I pledge allegiance to the establishment of the stupid democracy of the devil. Okay, who, 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 who was that man? Who took out the word God? Who was it? Think about it. Think about it, William. No. One nation under God. Who took you out under God? Obama. What president was it? Oh, good time. Oh, Obama. Obama. Oh, Bobby, Bobby, Bobby. He said America, uh -oh. America wasn't a Christian nation. No, it's in my Muslim faith. I mean, my Christian faith. Yeah, we got you, little devil. Yeah. We got you, little devil. We got you. We got you covered, Mr. Kenya. <laughs> in my Muslim faith. I mean, my Christian faith. Uh -huh. We got to get that man out. I don't even know what the bitch that thing is. Oh, Trump, Trump is so heavy. Bottom, please. Trump is so heavy in favor of winning and being popular. Who do they got else? A female, maybe? So the only thing they can do really is try to put him in jail. There ain't no way he can lose. Better put him in jail. He had a mugshot. That's character. Why they have Hillary? Hillary stupid in there. What? Oh, the law she broke, Hillary. Oh, oh, yeah. Nothing he done for it. He got president. Obama took stuff in the White House. You bet. He opened your president. You're allowed to take you out. You're talking to the gun. Yeah. Why they just said Biden done the same thing? He was a vice president. Oh, Ford. I didn't. And they said Obama did it. Obama did it. Obama admitted he was a Muslim. That's that one thing. All of them. All of them did. That's what he said. Oh, Tommy. And then they tried to go back and say. Oh, Tommy, the Tommy. And he did. And he did. Trans state. Trump don't care about it anyway. My fault. Show. They didn't make me. They went back. No other news. Out. Uh, that y'all can y'all can peacefully protest if y'all want to, and they was already tearing it down while he was yeah. standing doing that. So, he had nothing to do with that. That's right. It's, it's, it's crazy. This country is gone. Set up, I believe. It's just set up. Most of it is. Right. I'm a little entertained to say, "Oh my dear Lord, this is happening. I'm scared. Let me close it down. I Let's believe. see what I can trace." In my mind, <laughs> in my mind, I say it's my time. Well, that's my time. Like that. Just get him. What's the worst case scenario to get him? Because the Democrats been doing it. What about all this stuff? Black Lives Matter thing. That's militia. What about Harry? What about all these riots in the streets? Nah, that ain't one incident saying that the Republicans are tearing down the White House is for. That's right. That's right.